Warning, this game contains flashing colors and lights, and if you have epilepsy, you're probably gonna get fucked. What's up, YouTube? My name is Trip6, and welcome to Freaky Friday. Yes, this is a new segment we're doing once a week. On Fridays, we're playing some horror games. So, this week, uh, to kick things off, we're playing a game I found on Game Jolt called Indigar, made by uh, Vanadile Games. Vanadile? Vanadile? I'm not sure. Anywho! So I'm looking at the controls real quick. Doesn't look too, uh, too, 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 too elaborate. Cause I can't fucking think. We're gonna be fucked. Anywho, so, and if you guys have been around here for a while, you know that I absolutely hate horror games. So this should be fun, right? Right. Julia, your daughter is kidnapped in the apartment building. La Hasadia. Come if you want to save her, but I warn you, if you show up with someone else or you talk to the police, I will kill her. See you in that place in an hour! Okay, so we're starting off with some Taken type vibes, you know. I don't know who you are or what you want. If it's money you're after, I can promise you I have none. But what I do have is a very particular set of skills I've developed over a long career. I want you to know that I will find you. Whoa. It's too dark, I should find a way to turn on the lights. I have a flashlight. Time is on my side. Um, what is that supposed to mean exactly? Oh. Oh, this is just fucking dandy. What the fuck is that sound? Oh, hello, that... There's a delay. And I don't like it. Okay, that's... It's like hit or miss. And I'm not sure what's causing it. That is not gonna work out in my favor. Oh god, everything is so goddamn loud. Okay, here, you know what? Turn that down. This place will eat you? Oh! Close that door. Close that door. Oh, fuck me. Okay, door. That's good to fucking know. Once you open a door, you can't. Oh my god, this is so jittery. Okay, cool. Oh, you cannot see dick. What exactly am I looking for? Is this any help? Hang on. H hold. I can't change the settings. Okay. This is so fucking jittery. I don't know how far I'm gonna be able to go with this. Like, the camera is very jittery. And that is the best word I have to, to describe it. Can I close this door at least? Nope. Okay, so once you open a door, it stays open. Oh. Um, oh god, I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope that I do not have to run from anything. Because I will be fucked. Bent over a park bench, fucked. Okay, that door is locked. Cool. Yeah. Sugar the rabbit? Okay, I saw you in a thumbnail. That is concerning. What is so special about you, sugar? Okay. Oh, they do a very good job building up the ambiance. Oh, this is where everything goes wrong, isn't it? This one bit. What? I heard a toilet. Is there anything over here that's useful? No? Oh god, I hate this, 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 I hate this. Why do I agree to these things? Okay. Okay. I am a gigantic pussy when it comes to horror games. Nope, nothing here. Don't tell me I need to run and hide from things. Can I, like, I'll, I'll take a heart attack and a jump scare over having to run from anything right now because this is so goddamn jittery. And there's nothing I can do about it. 
I don't know if this is just programming error or if something is conflicting in my computer. I'm not 100% sure what I'm supposed to be doing. Something about finding my daughter. That is all I know. What is going on in there? Okay. Are you crying or fucking? Okay. This building is alive. Okay. Okay. Hey. Why do I have to be right on top of a door to fucking open it? Is there anything behind me? I hope not. I really hope not. Fuck. Why did I decide that Freaky Friday would be a good idea? I mean, it was suggested... Honey, I want to repair the hole in the wall for the guy in apartment one. He hides the hole with a bookcase that falls so easily that man is so weird. He stole three medals from that neighbor and kept them in his bedroom. Honey, I want to move. I'm sick of this place. I'm sick of this. Place is full of crazy people. Why only people like that live in this building? That's reassuring. Oh, that's just dandy. Can I turn on the light switch? You have to be right on top of things. Which is apartment one? Was that downstairs? Pretty sure they're fucking. Time is on my side. What is that supposed to mean? Like, the longer I spend in here, the more fucked up shit gets. Apartment two. Apartment one. Yeah, so I heard that toilet flush before when I was walking past here, and now those legs are gone. And I can't move the- okay. It did say apartment one, right? Okay, let's check this out first, I guess. There's gonna be a jump scare sooner or later, there's gotta be. If this entire game is entirely scenic and auditory, then I might be a little dis- There it is. Do you fucking mind? You are obnoxious. A lot of things in this game are obnoxious, like the fucking door. The doors are obnoxious. The people humping in room six or whatever. Apartment six. Do I get a weapon? Like, can I? It's a pipe. Can I crouch? Nope, okay. Okay. Samuel, I'm tired of your offenses and humiliations. I love you and always will, but I can't be with you anymore. I know these medals make you feel horrible, but I don't understand why you get so upset when I put them on the medal holders. You were, f you were a fourth place, you were a second place, you were a third place, never the first. You were never the best at something, you were not even a good husband. Ouch! My wife left me this morning and my tennis career is over. My neighbor has taken my medals, but it does not matter. These second, third, and fourth place medals just remind me of how mediocre and useless I am. Nah, I'm sure nobody is better than me. I'm the most talented. I am the best. What? Okay, that's actually good to know that I cannot run. That is a little reassuring that I don't have to run from anything. What the fuck am I looking for? Jesus, okay, I just happened to click in the right spot, apparently. Why? Just... Just 
why? Okay. I obtained the three medals. I am still paranoid that I'm gonna have to run from something. I don't think I'm gonna have to. I really hope so, anyways. Because that would suck. That would suck all the dicks. Every, every last dick would be sucked. And there's still people fucking in room four? Yep, room four, okay. They're still banging it out in there, got it. And when I say people, I most likely mean monsters from your nightmares, but... Apply. Nothing happens. You were a fourth, a second, and a third. Fourth, second, third, apply. This is super obnoxious. Help! Jesus! Where the fuck did you come from? <sighs> wake up, wake up, it will come back. It wants to torture you, you have to hurry. You only have a few moments before it returns. Find a silver amulet before time runs out. When you find it, that thing will not come for you anymore. What silver amulet? Oh. Who are you? Your voice seems familiar. Are you my daughter? <sighs> There's no time for that. Find the silver, silver amulet before time runs out. It has to be in one of the apartments. Oh, you are kidding me. No, 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 no. You get two fucking minutes. Two and a half minutes to search this entire apartment building and you cannot run. Oh, this is a big old bag of fucking hooky dukes right here. I can't run. I can't jump. All right, let's check. Apartment four, please be open this time. Nothing, oh are you fucking with me? I can't open that one either. Stop it. It's gotta be one that I couldn't get into before. Please, 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 please. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Open, 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 fuck. What silver? Amulet. Are these any different? No. Check this bullshittery here. Can't do anything with that. This is bullshit. This is a copious amount of bullshit. Okay, the TV's not jump scaring me again. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. This door open? No. Where am I supposed to? 25 seconds. Oh my god. Well, where am I supposed to go? Waiting for the jump scare. That siren is obnoxious, that's why I'm taking the headphones off. Hi there! Of course you'd attack me as soon as I put my fucking headphones back on. 
That is super obnoxious, though. <sighs> Do I get unlimited tries with this, at least? What's even worse is I cannot pause the game right now. <sighs> Two minutes on the clock again. Probably, anyways. Two minutes, 30 seconds on the clock. This is gonna be in a really dumb spot, too, isn't it? I'm just taking my time. It's gotta be upstairs here, that's my guess. You almost find it? What? Oh, I can't move the bookshelf again. Alright. Doing this again. Now what? That's a very good fucking question. Now what? Maybe... Oh... Hi... So you want your daughter? She belongs to me now. You are so miserable. She deserves a better mom. You'll have to kill me to take her from me, but I warn you, I'm not easy to kill. Kill you. So much of this makes no sense. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, that's the end of it. Okay, so that was a demo. That was an early access. I had forgotten to mention that at the start of the video. I'm kind of glad that ended when it did, because, like I said, I've been recording for like 30 minutes already. I gotta say, that wasn't. Excuse me. That wasn't horrible. I kind of do like the idea of the uh, the the building eating you, because it's like a really old horror um, ideology. I guess is the good word for it, uh, or speculation. Like, what if the house eats you? Like, you know, Monster House, like the cartoon animation that. Uh, yeah, you know what I mean. But um, like, there's SCPs that revolve around like buildings that eat you, and like the insides are like human flesh and shit, and that's really fucking cool. But, um, they did a really good job with the audio in this, I believe. Uh, certain things could have been toned down. Um, I don't understand why the people fucking in room 4 was necessary. People are... Monsters. Probably monsters. Most likely monsters. Um... And why did it turn out... That the fucking rabbit... Was the main... Like... Antagonist, I guess. Flashing lights and effects, player discretion is advised. There was no flashing lights. I, I forgot about that. There was nothing flashing. Definitely not what I was expecting. Um, I would love to see the controls get tightened up, and it, again, that might not be me. That might, or that might not be the game. That might be my setup. Uh, there's a very good possibility of that, that the, uh, for some reason, my graphics card is not rendering it properly. Um, or not, not that it's not rendering it properly, but that it's uh, lagging it. I don't know. I don't know 100%, um, but it is a possibility. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much all there is to it. However, I did read on the uh, the Game Jolt page that uh, a new demo is coming out soon, and that was posted quite a while ago. I've, I've had this game downloaded for quite a while, too, and I just haven't played it, so I don't know if I have the newest update or if there's one coming. I'd be willing to see where this goes, though. I do like that there is no 
true penalty for trial and error because it does like when you realize that once you do realize that there is no penalty it does relax the game considerably that like yeah okay i'm gonna get jump scared if i don't do this but at the same time it's not hand holding like you it does not help you necessarily to find like that silver amulet like it expects you to literally go room by room and with trial and error. It's so I, I can appreciate that. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. And if you liked it, destroy that like button. Be sure to check back for more freaking content. And I will see all of you in the next video. Later.